year. I'm also very excited because I'm getting married. Thank you, thank you very much. I don't, um, I don't actually know who the guy is yet, but uh, maybe he's here tonight, my future ex-husband, we will see. No, I am single, I, I've got bad luck dating, I do. I, I had a really difficult time getting over my ex-boyfriend. He was this really good looking, charming guy, right? He, he had a great sense of humor. He was always up for a good prank right? Like he would do this thing. I would be like washing the dishes or folding the laundry or whatever. And he would do this thing where he would sneak out and bone all of these women and then pretend that he didn't. <laughs> it was hilarious. <laughs> so ultimately, you know, we tried having an open relationship, um, which would have been awesome, you know, if I had known. That's what we were doing. One of the reasons that my ex-boyfriend broke up with me was because that he said that he was tired of having the conversation with me that I don't listen, which is weird because I don't even remember having that conversation with him. <laughs> uh, I was dating an older man, was an older man, and uh, it feels very weird to see an older man naked. Am I right, ma'am? Mm? <laughs> right? No, every time he would take his clothes off, I felt like I was about to be attacked by a beanbag chair. You know what I mean? Right, and they have that saggy old man bomb, you know, sir. You know, it feels very weird and unnatural to see that bum naked, right? But older gentlemen, they have that sense of chivalry that younger men just don't have anymore, right? And, and, and that's why I find it a bit rude when people assume that I'm attracted to older men because I have daddy issues, right? When it has so much more to do with the fact that I'm craving their pension and their estate, right? <laughs> One of the problems that I've had um, is when I'm with somebody for a very long time, it's very hard to keep it spicy in the bedroom, right? It's hard to keep the fire alive after all of those years of togetherness, right? I mean, like, clown masks and adult diapers can only do it for me so many times. <laughs> I'm not an animal, right? But I figured something out. I figured out that if I got my man hammered to the point where he would pass out, then I could have my way with him, right? <laughs> so he would drink, 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 fall asleep, and then I would cuddle the crap out of him. I'd be like, yeah, you like that? Oh, yeah. I'm gonna spoon you all night. Bear hug, oh, yes. Talk to you about my day, oh. Talk about our future, yes. Thank you guys so much. You guys have been wonderful, thank you.